Hi, I'm Nicole Mizuguchi and this is a short demo to show you how to draw stars using colored pencils. I'm using Prismacolor pencils and black paper and starting out with a white pencil and then adding some color. So what I'm starting out with is just a little white circle and spinning around and letting it lighter and lighter as it goes out and that kind of looks like a glow or a halo around the star. And then I'm doing a little technique that's kind of like a little wiggle and whoosh to do the line. So wiggle, whoosh. And that just kind of tapers the line so it looks like it's a star beam that's coming out and I'm drawing the horizontal and vertical lines of the star. And you see I just added some little moons or little planets there around the star. And here I'm just drawing two circles and using that same technique we go and whoosh. horizontal and vertical and it's just a slight variation on that same star technique where there's a sort of a circular shape in the middle and then the horizontal and vertical lines coming out now this one's slightly different I've got the lines going diagonally and then horizontal and vertically coming out the side and you'll notice a little circle in the middle and also notice that the horizontal line is slightly longer than the other ones. So I'm drawing this the same star technique here with the diagonal lines and then the other lines coming out. But on this one, I'm doing a kind of spiraling line around it so it looks like it's glowing a little bit more, a little bit more depth to the star. Now the stars that I've been drawing so far have been just freehand and it's kind of more difficult to get the lines straight. It's more of an organic looking star but you can also use a ruler or a card stock or something like that that helps you to get a straight line. So that's what I'm doing here. It really helps if you have a see-through ruler so that you can really see how to get the lines lined up. So next I'll be adding a little bit of color. So, so far everything's been just white lines on black paper and it's a similar basic star technique but you can see how you can make the stars look a little bit different. So this is basically just a practice page to practice how to do stars. So I've just added some yellow around that star and then also some orange and it gets a little bit lighter as it goes out and then I've just blended the color orange all the way through there so it just gives it a little bit of glow and I've just picked up a sort of a light blue turquoisey color and this gives a, a little blue glow coming off of this star it's kind of a, a star beam I can imagine out there in space somewhere all the little lights coming off of it so I'm just going around um, starting from the center and then radiating out and the line gets a little bit softer or lighter as it comes out towards the edge. So I'm slightly picking up my pencil as the line goes outward. And then I'm coming in and adding a little bit longer line in certain areas so it doesn't look like a ball of hair or anything like that. It looks like a, a star beam so some of the lines need to be a little bit longer. Than the other ones so there's a variation it looks like it's shining and I'm adding a little bit of pink here to this one I've seen on some Hubble space um, photographs um, some pink stars or pink planets or something like that so um, that's what gave me the idea to add a little bit of pink glow um, So 
So you can see I've added some orange on some and yellow and then blue on other ones and pink. And this one I'm adding sort of a golden warm yellow. Just imagine that glowing out in space. And then I'm going back on top of this and um, brightening up the white so it really looks like it's shining. So you can use this technique and uh, practice the star technique so that when you draw stars or paint them on uh, paper or fabric or um, canvas or whatever you use a star technique on, then you can use this uh, variation and, and try a different way to see the stars and capture that light. So that's a star technique and I hope you enjoyed the video. Thanks for watching.